UAE and Ireland discuss regional developments. So the UAE Minister of Foreign Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Abdul, uh, Abdullah bin Zayed Al Nahyan recently engaged in a fruitful discussion with Michael Martin, the, de- uh, the Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Minister of Ireland regarding the latest developments in the region. The conversation primarily focused on the crucial topics of protecting civilians, ensuring the safe passage of humanitarian aid and addressing the challenges posed by extremism. During their call, Sheikh Abdullah and Minister Michal Martin underscored the urgent need to establish secure humanitarian corridors to facilitate delivery of relief and medical assistance to those in need. This emphasis on safeguarding civilian lives amid the ongoing crisis reflects the shared commitment of both nations to prioritize the well-being and safety of individuals affected by regional conflicts. Furthermore, the two ministers delved into the board a broader scope of regional and international efforts aimed at combating extremism and curbing es- escalating violence, recognizing the destructive consequences that such cries have on civilian populations. They highlighted the importance of collective action to mitigate these risks and protect innocent lives. In the discussion, Sheikh Abdullah and Minister Martin stressed the significance of intensifying efforts to restore security and stability in the region by promoting dialogue, cooperation and collaborative initiatives, both countries seek to foster an environment conductive to peace and prosperity. This is between the UAE and Ireland, but we're seeing a major collaboration and we'll also look at the Egypt's hosting of a summit uh, in the coming days, which brings together a lot more countries. However, this exchange between the UAE and Ireland serves as a testament to the enduring commitment of nations to address pressing regional challenges through sustained cooperation and a shared vision for a more secure and stable future. They strive to make tangible progress in resolving complex issues and of improving the lives of those affected. As the international community continues to grapple with the complexities of the regional dynamics ongoing right now, the UAE and Ireland stand united in their dedication to promoting peace, protecting civilians and advancing humanitarian efforts. Their dialogue sets a positive precedent for diplomatic engagement and underscores the importance of collective action in addressing regional crisis effectively. Egypt intends to host also an international summit to address the current crisis in Gaza. Uh, the country's presidency has said they hastily arranged the summit, which will take place on October 1st in Cairo. Uh, it brings together Turkey, Iraq, Qatar, among others, uh, to kind of extend this dialogue. Exactly. And we're seeing a lot of community members speaking out right now. We see your sentiments. And of course, like we said in the beginning of the show, our Thoughts and prayers are with all the civilians affected by this and with Gaza right now. Uh, But we will jump into 